that's where you find yourself. You find yourself when you are the at, when you're not comfortable. When you're not comfortable on a daily basis. And that's how I started to grow. Like I said about the mind, it wants to put you in that nice 72 degree temperature with, with everything right there. It wants to be in that nice with a little massage therapist. That's where your mind wants to be. Find some difficult shit to do because that gets away a lot of the anxiety that you carry around in your body. A lot of like difficult things make regular life less difficult. And that sounds so simplistic, but particularly physically difficult things. Because when you do things that are physically difficult, the strain of making yourself do those things, it's very valuable. It's not just valuable like exercise and fitness and martial arts and running and whatever you're doing that's really difficult. It's not just valuable in terms of like health and the way you look, but it's also valuable for your mind, maybe even more so. Because regular life can be confusing and little things that go wrong and little problems that arise are exacerbated by the fact that you're not accustomed to dealing with hardship. We go through stuff, you know what? Whenever I face anything that's challenging, whenever anything sucks, I like it. I like it. It's gonna make, it's gonna make me tougher. It's gonna give me a good story to tell. It's gonna toughen my mind. It's gonna bring us together as a church. You know what military training is? You know what military training is? You know how they form a bond in military groups? They make you do stuff that sucks. That's what they do. What's boot camp? It's a suck fest. What I realized about the mind is those people who can be in that time and embrace that time and be in that moment and not allow the mind to go to 129 hours on hour one. It's the control that we don't have in our minds. It's the control that you had to have for three months when you're miserable, when you're suffering, when you're laying on the floor, when you're doing all the disciplines it takes to be a monk. You cannot think about the whole process. It will make you, it, it, will, it will make you so insanely crazy. It's impossible. It's inhumane what I'm about to do to myself. You have to be able to break all these big, humongous, painful things in life down to the smallest molecule.